those of you that remember, uh, Greg, Uncle Greg, the sit-in people are filling in for the nieces and nephews that are not here, um, <laughs> has established a game for the niece and nephews to play to get their Christmas from Uncle Greg. And uh, the first year he did it was a competition of letters. writing letters. And the most creative or most thoughtful letter um, was awarded a nice gift certificate. And uh, Maggie won the first year with a very creative tie, you know, tea dyed, hand scripted, not notative, noted letter. So the second year, <laughs> Uncle Greg sent this card game in which the um, names are on the table and the cards are going to be passed. And then at the end of his instructions, everyone opens their cards to see who gets the grand prize. Yeah. So, here we begin. Everyone sit around the table and we have stand-ins. Those not present, we still use the name tag and uh, we're having people pad, plat, pass for them. The red cards are in front of each chair. Okay, <laughs> here is round number one. Pass the cards to the left, two positions. To the left. One, one two. two. Okay. Now, pass to the right five positions. Well, that's going to be harder. One, you have to count. Two, three, four, five. Are you sure? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, to the left three times. There you go, John Roberts. You're moving. One, away. two, two <laughs> three. three. I'm confused. Okay. <coughs> now, to the right, two places. One, two. two. Now, a, a piece that the pawpaw missed is there's supposed to be a writing implement on the table. Uh oh, we didn't cover that. Oh, what <coughs> were you supposed to have been doing this whole time? Use the pepper. <laughs> I think we're just There's one of the judges, Grandma's over there. Okay, put your name on the card. It's a red letter. You guys, I'm Sharpie. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see what color it was. What good's that going to do? You can you tell. You can see it. Yeah, put barely. John Roberts' name on his card. <laughs> I think this is to identify, Use especially for the ones name, who are Pam. not here. Obviously. Obviously. Yeah, thank you. <clears throat> <laughs> and in Ian's case, he will transcribe <laughs> his <laughs> Uncle Greg's name <coughs> because that's the given name that his uncle calls him. <laughs> Here, let me pay. <laughs> but he's not the only one that spells it that way. His great Aunt Judy spells it the same way. <laughs> now, the instructions are to open your cards. Well, we don't open for the these other guys, do the, the mm -hmm. stand-ins. No, you have to because you got to know who oh. wins. So even if you're a stand-in, open the card, really and good. we'll see what they say. Who, who is in charge of the drum roll? We don't hey. have a drum roll. Oh, it's you. No drum roll. Grace, I've got my hands full. <clears throat> okay, mm. Maggie, what's your say? You have fifty dollars added to your gift trust. Merry Christmas. Okay, read for John Roberts. John Roberts says you have $50 added to your gift trust. Uh -oh. Merry Christmas, y Uncle Greg, why don't you write? Ah. Uh, John Roberts. This one says um, there's $50 added to your gift trust. Merry Xmas, Uncle Greg, never hear from you. Ah. Oh. Michael Reed. This one says you have $50 put in your gift oh. trust. Merry Christmas. Oh. <laughs> You were a lucky winner this year. <gasps> Spend it wisely or put it in your other $50 that was put in your gift trust. No Merry Christmas. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> and what did you get? He didn't, Money. He didn't get a Merry Christmas. I didn't ah. No yeah. Merry Christmas. <coughs> what is this? It <laughs> says season's greetings. <coughs> oh. That's <laughs> copacetic. That's what do you say? For Katie, uh -oh. there's $50 <laughs> put in your gift trust. Merry Christmas, Uncle Greg. Try the phone once in a while. <laughs> Phones in Australia. Ah. 
Now, the, the directions time. after you open your when card is to write your thank you letters uh, no. and mail them as soon as possible. Right. This begins next year's game. Wow. So, uh, <coughs> he must have something planned when you write your thank you. He may be sending you something back to work on for next year. Or <laughs> maybe if you don't write a thank you, you may not get in next yeah, year. Yeah, you may not get in. <laughs> Any comments by yeah, anyone other than the it. winner? I go to confession every week now. This is what God gives you when you do nice stuff for him. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Gas money well spent. <clears throat> Oh. <laughs> Any other losers like to give comments? <laughs> 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 no, <laughs> fine. They're I'll fine. <laughs> Any more thank you yous? Thank John you. Robert? Oh, I'm I'm down here. Oh, oh John right. Robert, we will find out why he does not write. <laughs> <laughs> Go over all those comments. Let's see. Hmm? Any commentary for the benefit? Thank you. I will start writing my letter as soon as possible. <laughs> all right. I have something to say. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> You've opened up a can of worms with this spelling, I think. Katie, what do you have to say? Well, I, I think uh, I find it hard to imagine that Katie is not on the phone. Well, I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> I know one reason I can't find her at home either. <laughs> That's for sure. So we have a, a round of applause for the narrator. <laughs> what do you say, Grandma? Anything? Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs>